It's that type of morning. Doing a little black on blackberry today. Love this flavor. It's not my favorite, but it's one of the best. It's this. This one, Hype Sauce is my favorite. I love Hype Sauce. This one, Hype Sauce. Um, and God, there's so many other good ones, but I think I like the PewDiePie, like Lingonberry or however you say it. It's so good. So yummy. Yes. Give me that sweet nectar. <sighs> I'm not ready. What is going on, everybody? Welcome back to another Pokemon Sword and Shield video. Today, I'm going to be showing you guys something a little different than what I planned on putting up on the channel today. I was 100% ready to put up the Charizard video, but then I remembered that the Pokemon International Challenge 2020 sign-up had started over the week while I was busy with school stuff and wasn't paying attention. And I'm going to show you guys how to sign up for that, because if you want to participate, now's the time to register. I think it, the registration goes from the 19th, which was a couple days ago, like I said, till the 27th. So I'm going to show you guys exactly how to do this. I'm going to take you over to the game and just show you what you got to do to sign up for this tournament. So I'm going to bring us over. And you're going to open up your Ycom and connect to the internet. I am already connected, so you guys know how to do that. I'd hope so at this point at least. Oops, wrong button. So what you're going to do is you're going to come over here to Versus. You're going to go over to Battle Stadium. If it ever loads. Then you're going to go to Online Competitions. Online competitions can be broken down into categories, official competitions, and friendly competitions, blah, blah, blah. They're going to give you all this fun information. And then you're going to hit search for official competitions. You can see it says accepting applications. You're going to click that right there. It's the International Challenge February Masters Division. And uh, your time, seven minutes, blah, blah, blah. It shows you all the rules, number of battles, max of 45 battles a day. Uh, double battle rank battle series 2 so it's the rules from this co current competitive season so make sure you're up to date on those if you're interested in participating in this tournament you're going to hit a please make sure you read the following warnings participation in the competition only one user per system is allowed to participate and you will need to link it to a pokemon trainer club account so you need to have your whatever profile you're using on your nintendo switch that online account needs to be connected to a pokemon trainer club account I have made a video covering exactly how to do that. So if you guys need to know how to link to a Pokemon Trainer Club account, I will link that video. I'll either put a little thingy card up in the corner of the screen somewhere here, or I will link it at the end of the video for you guys. You got to read all the rules and then you hit enter. You check the status of the competition. And then I, I would imagine after you register, you're all good. You're all set. You're good to go. So then, I, it says the ending sign-up period is around the 27th, so I'd imagine the competition is over that weekend of the 28th, 29th, and the 1st. That is my guess. I haven't found anything showing the exact time that the tournament is going to go down, but yeah. So, just one little thing I wanted to show you guys before I ended this video, because I did manage to find the dates for this competition, and it is the 27th of February to the 1st of march so it is that weekend like i predicted so i'll be sure to put this in the video somewhere so you guys know the exact times but yeah it is that weekend so that is what you need to know to participate in this tournament so from this you'll get an exclusive like pokeball guy t-shirt for your in-game character which i think is pretty cool kind of similar to the rewards you got for pre-ordering uh the dlc expansions for this game like the Pikachu shirt and the Eevee shirt something similar in that vein and all you have to do to obtain that Pokeball shirt in Pokemon Sword and Shield is participate in one battle in this tournament so that is all you got to do you get a cool little reward if you don't actually want to participate in the tournament then you don't get the shirt and it, there, it's no harm no foul this is just kind of something fun to do and it does accumulate you championship points so you can participate in worlds if that's a goal of yours so only thing left to do at that point is you just got to get your teams ready Pick, figure out what you want to do. I'm working on this Flapple team where they go. This Flapple team here that I'm going to be training up and hopefully have ready to go by the time the tournament starts. So that is my game plan. Use this team. Have a good time with it. And then I'm also going to be starting breeding a future team for the next competitive season. So there's a lot of stuff going on. The Charizard video, like I said at the start of the video, I had planned for today. Uh, the Charizard video features this team here. 
and it will go up tomorrow because I do want to get that video up. I've been kind of postponing it just because stuff has been going on with school and other information has come up with Pokemon, like Pokemon Home came out. So that video will go up tomorrow. I promise you that'll be the first thing I do in the morning. So expect a Charizard team video tomorrow, but that is all I have for you guys today. That is how you sign up for the Pokemon International Challenge 2020 if you're interested in it. And like I said, you do need to link that Trainer Club account, and if you need to know how to do that, I will have it linked either in the description below. I'll have a little card thingy somewhere in the video, or I'll make sure to put it at the end of the video for you guys to go check that out. But that is all I have for you guys today. I hope you found this video entertaining and helpful, and if you did, be sure to leave a like and smash that subscribe button for more videos like this in the future. Be sure to share the video with your friends. Let's grow this community we have going here on the channel speaking of community be sure to check out the community discord we have a great time in there we do shiny hunts we do max rates we do a whole bunch of fun stuff and sometimes when i'm streaming i'll hop in there and we get some people in there and we do you know we chat and we do some raids and stuff it's a good time so check that out if you're interested all my other social media should be on screen here if you're interested in keeping up with the channel but like i said that's all i have for you guys today thank you so much for watching i'll see you all in the next video